Greetings and a very well welcome to Inside Ethiopia channel. Stay tuned. The incoming United States Ambassador Geta Pasi gave an interview to the Ethiopian Herald saying that Tigray People's Liberation Front TPLF messed up the country's economic, political and social endeavors, creating policies shaped to feed them all in power during their regime. The newly incoming U.S. ambassador to Ethiopia said the policies formulated by TPLF has resulted in significant economic and political crises such as unemployment, inflation and the non-inclusive growth rate. According to sources, the ambassador added the existing land policies disallow the farmers to own their land across Ethiopia. Ambassador Passi appointed to U.S. Embassy in Ethiopia right after Joe Biden's administration being on power. And the ambassador has this to say about Ethiopian Prime Minister Dr. Abi on an interview a couple of months back with Senator Bab regarding the democratization process that the premier started. There's this lack of inclusiveness, which I think that the prime minister welcomed when he first came. He's faced a lot of challenges now with Tigray and with some other groups. I believe that we can help him work toward the democracy that he wants, the democracy that we want, and what is needed in Ethiopia. Thank you. The ambassador also expressed how TPLF ruled the country, leaving any sort of political room for opposition political leaders or other individuals that belonged to other races rather than one tribe and one tribe only. Thank you, sir. Uh, we really appreciated your statement. Um, I think that Ethiopia is a country that for many years was ruled by one small group, the Tigray, uh, under the TPLF, the group that you mentioned um, has been uh, in conflict with the federal government. Um, it's hard to make a transition, I think, where a country was controlled by a small group and have an inclusive process. I think the main issue that, if confirmed, I would stress to my interlocutors in Ethiopia, and I would hope that others in Washington would be raising this view at different levels and through other channels, that the process of democracy can't be about one person. It has to be about the institutions, civil society, all the groups. Ambassador further explained how unemployment, inflation, and the non-inclusive growth rate has been such a headache in Ethiopia since TPLF had monopolized the economy with their relatives in their power, of course. But now it's all going to be history. For Ethiopia got this incredible Nobel Peace Prize winner and most of all humble and thoughtful Prime Minister Abi to be proud of. Given all the challenges, the Prime Minister still manages to bring a number of reforms to the country ever since he is on power. Thanks for staying with us. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe and leave your comments. Have a good one.